show you how to make, how to use, and how to solve using a clinometer. A clinometer is an instrument that measures vertical slope, usually the angle between the ground or the observer and a tall object. First step, find the 180 degrees protractor. This type of protractor is shaped like a half circle with angles marked all around the rim. Second step, tape a straw along the straight edge. Tape a straight plastic drinking straw on or near the straight edge of the protractor. Make sure the straw passes through the two zero degrees or zero marks on opposite ends of the straight edge. Third step, Tie a string through the small hole on the straight edge. Last step, attach a small weight to the dangling end of the string. How to use a clinometer? Find a tall tree or building, flag pole, etc. In a place where there is plenty of space to move away from the object that you are measuring. Look through the straw and find the the top of the tree. Ask your friend to read the angle being recorded on the clinometer. This is read where the string or cotton is touching the protractor. Measure the distance between where you are standing and the base of the tree. Measure the distance from your eyes to the ground. This is where your partner in, is indispensable. Add these two distances together. Because to be most accurate, the triangle has to finish at your feet, not your eyes. You now have a very close approximation of the height of the tree, building or other tall structure. How to solve using a clinometer? First, illustrate the data that you have. Next, find OHA. O is for opposite, H is for hypotenuse, and A is for adjacent. The opposite is x, since x is opposite to the 30 degree angle in the right triangle. Do not mind the hypotenuse, because in this situation, it is not needed. Your adjacent is the distance between the person and the pole. For this situation, our adjacent is 891 cm. Using the Sokotoa method, wherein TOA is tan data is equals to opposite over adjacent. Substitute the given formula with the data that you have. Multiply both sides with your denominator. In our case, we have 891 times tan 30. Now, multiply. The product of ours is 514.42. Wait, it's not yet done. You need to add the height of the person until his or her eye level. In our case, 514.42 is added to 148 centimeters. Our sum is 662.42 centimeters which is also the answer of our x. And there you have it! The height of the flagpole is approximately 662.42 centimeters. Thank you for watching!
Sec sec <laughs> sec <laughs> second step. Tape a straw along the straight edge. Tape a straight plastic drinking straw on or near the straight edge of the protractor. Make sure the straw passes through the two zero degrees or zero marks on opposite ends of the straight edge. Third step. Tie a string through the small hole on the straight edge. Many protractor. Hindi na yung kasama. Third step na lang. Third step. Tie a string through the small hole on the straight edge. Last na ba to? Oh, last na to. Attach a small weight to the dangling. To the da... Anong basa dito? Dangling. Dangling. Okay, okay. Paano yung members and members? Last step. Attach a small weight to the dangling end of the string. Small weight? Ano yung small weight? Yung benching ko? Okay na yun. Yun na yun. Okay na yun. K-pop. K-pop. Ayan, K-pop. 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 K-pop.